the livelihood of Samtal residents are likely to suffer following the listing of tawilis, a freshwater sardine and a popular delicacy as an endangered species. The government says there will be safety nets for the fisher folk to be affected. Shaila Francisco has the story. After a seven-month break, Rudy is raring to resume catching tawilis again this March. Problem is, tawilis has just been declared an endangered species by the International Union for Conservation of Nature or IUCN. We have sa balita na yan, diyan kami nag-aalala na baka patigil ng yan, pagbawalan. E, paano naman ang pagkain ng mga tao namin, mga hilador namin. Paano yung pamilya namin kung dila lang kami naasa? Retailers of tawilis are now also worried about their livelihood. Mawawala kami ng hanap buhay. At saka yan, marami sinusupply ang mga resort, hotel, restaurant. Bombon sardine or tawilis, the only freshwater sardine in the world, can only be found in Taal Lake. But according to the IUCN, overexploitation, pollution and competition with other species is now threatening the tawilis. Data show that from over a thousand metric tons in 1998, fish catch has now declined to 217 metric tons in 2017. But fishermen insist a fish catch has not declined because of decreasing population. Ang isda, iyan iyan ipagkaganitong ang hangin, ang panahon, ay lubog, malalim. The National Fisheries Research and Development Institute, however, explained that the declaration was for preservation purposes. Ikumpara mo ngayon, pa ilan-ilan na lang, although nakakahuli pa rin sila. So gusto nating ibalik yung dating dami sa, ng tawili sa lawa. The Institute has recommended a closed fishing season from March to April and the establishment of Tawilis Reserve Area in the spawning grounds. Pinahayaan natin ang tawilis manganak ng manganak during their spawning season. So ang effect nila, the, pag lumaki yun, marami silang mahuhuli. The government is also ready to give cash for work program or alternative livelihood to those affected. Shaila Francisco, we are One News.